What's up guys, Hong Liu here for OG Fitness, a smart, sustainable, and functional approach to fitness and martial arts. And today, I wanna to talk to you guys about why I stopped drinking. Uh, drinking alcohol, that is. Now, there's two main reasons, okay? And the first one is because it fucks with my sleep. If I drink, okay, I don't sleep as well. And uh, when I wake up the next day, I'm tired, okay? And I don't like to be tired at this point in my life because a lot, I have a lot of things I wanna do, a lot of things I wanna achieve. You know, I gotta win competitions, I gotta train, you know, um, a lot of things. So if I'm tired, I mean, fuck man, it, it, it fucks everything up. And, and I lose like a day, man, a whole fucking day feeling like shit and, uh, and and we're not even talking about drinking a lot here I'm talking about like if I drink uh, the most I could probably get away with is maybe one pint but if I drink anywhere if I drink over a pint so we're talking like two and over I'm screwed so I'll feel like shit and of course the more you drink and if you really get wasted then it's it's terrible you know but if I drink like two pints I lose like about a fucking I lose a whole fucking day and I, I'm tired and shit, so I really don't enjoy that, right? Because I have things to do, and I can't do things if I'm tired, and my my motivation is is all is is in the slumps because uh, you know you're tired. When you're tired, there's a whole bunch of shit that um, you, you're not at your best. And now the um, the other thing is, and this relates to not sleeping well. If you don't sleep well you don't recover fast. So if you're a guy that trains, okay, and you have objectives and you wanna, you know, you want gains, uh, you wanna be able to perform uh, physically, right? I mean, like if you, um, if you don't recover fast and recovering, a big part of it is sleep. So if you don't, if, you, if your sleep is fucked up, okay, then obviously you're not gonna recover as fast. And if you can't recover as fast, well, you can't, uh, you, you can't train as as much so to me it's it's just not worth it at this point anymore i i've done it when i was in my my 20s my 20s to my 30s i was a fucking party animal and um that's for another video but i mean if i had to do it again i would probably still party a little bit and structure it much much more uh intelligently so anyways but now i'm i'm pushing 40. I'm 39, so like drinking to me, it's like okay, you know, uh, been there, done that. Uh, time to fucking move on. Does it relax me? No. If I want to relax, I'll I'll just go to bed or I'll watch uh, I'll watch something on TV or I'll take a fucking hot bath, you know, or do some some stretching and and you know like uh, massaging my body with a foam roller and uh, cross lacrosse balls and stuff like that, so that you know. And or you know just do breathing exercises, but the thing is, there's too too much downside and very little upside to drinking because when you drink, I mean what? Ah, uh, you talk a little bit loud. Yeah, it's fun, but fuck, man, there's there's a there's a fuck ton of shit that that goes wrong afterwards, you know. And um, so that's it. That's my two cents on that. And I feel great. Like yesterday after training, I went to. Uh, like like all Wednesdays after judo, right? I go I go hang out with the boys, you know, the coaches and stuff like that. We we grab a drink. But now what I do instead is that well I, I go with them, but I just order a, a Coke or a Perrier. You know, Perrier is better. There's no fucking sugar, so it's better for you. Um, but yeah, but after that, like the next day, you you're, you're okay. You're good. You're still good to go. You hit the ground running, and that's what you want to do if you want to um, you know stay in shape. Uh, you want to achieve your physical goals or your um, uh, your goals when it comes to to uh, to doing uh, performing in your sport or hell even in life you know like if you drink like at one point you got to cut this shit out you know and there's a really good line in um, The Sopranos it's it's an old TV show but you know you guys probably know it and at one point uh, Tony Soprano tells his uh, his his uh, his junkie uh, nephew. And he was telling him, because was, his junkie nephew was hooked on heroin and shit. So he just basically told him, listen, if you're a real fucking man, you don't need anything to get you through the day. All right? So that kind of stuck with me throughout the years. And I think I, 
I finally kind of get that now. Like, I realize, you know, I don't need this fucking shit to, to you know, to get drunk and shit like that. Like, yes, if you, if let's say you want to drink, it's New Year's Eve and shit like that. Okay, that's, that's cool, right? But you just got to make sure, like, uh, if it takes you a day to recover, make sure you plan it out so that you don't have anything to do the next day. You know, because you're probably not going to be very functional. Now, if you really go hard and you get your, uh, you get really fucking drunk, right? Well, it's probably going to be more like two days, depending on how fast you recover. But anybody over the age of fucking 30, you're not going to recover that fast, you know? Um, so that's it, you know? Like, there's nothing wrong with drinking. But if you're doing it on a regular basis, like, I'm... I'm pretty sure it's fucking you up and you're not performing as, uh, as well as you, you could be. And uh, you probably don't have as, as much energy as, as you, you could have. And, you know, to be honest, like feeling strong and energetic, it's, it's addictive. Like, I like this feeling. So why fuck it up? Like, for what? For, you know, like, yeah, have fun, but once in a while, man. So, yeah, that's it, guys. Uh, that's why I stopped drinking alcohol. Uh, not to say that I'll ever not drink again, but oh, on the flip side, you save money too if you if you drink less, right? <laughs> so that's it for this video, guys. Um, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.